In this month's community feature, we'll visit with friends from South Coast Artists to learn how this organization fosters a greater appreciation and participation in the arts in our community. Every Fresh and Local spotlights our community. Cardi's Furniture and Mattresses is proud to support Fresh and Local. Especially Joe Zito's community feature. The mission of the South Coast Artists is actually fascinating because it serves the artists and it serves the community. Artists can be very, very solitary in their careers. So having a network of other artists that you can turn to is wonderful. But more than that, opening the studios to the community means that people who have no idea what art is get a free day. They can come into studios, see artists, they can see the artwork in the environment that it was made in. And it makes such a difference to the quality of life, understanding the art in the community, understanding that your neighbors are doing something kind of amazing. This is the 19th year for our open studio tour, South Coast Artist Open Studio Tour, in the four towns of Tiverton, Little Compton, Dartmouth, and Westport, Massachusetts, and Rhode Island. And we have 75 artists who open their studio doors and their home doors and invite people in to see how they make a living, how they create their work, and what inspires them. People come, they get to see the artists actually work. They get to see the work in progress, whether they're a sculptor or a woodcover or a jeweler, painter, whatever that it may be. To introduce the tour each year for the past five years, we've had an invitational exhibit. The invitational will take place at the Dee Dee Shattuck Gallery in Westport. The end of the month, the 29th, it starts and then it ends the 29th of May. And each artist can have up to three pieces. So there's a lot of artwork for people to get familiar with the artist before the tour. The membership of South Coast Artists is over 170 members and they're all visual artists, so they're no dance or, or music. But visual art can be anything that you see with your eyes. So we have jewelers, we have potters, we have people who make books, we have uh, painters, we have sculptors, we have metal workers. And the range of art that can be found in this community is amazing. South Coast Artists is an interesting group because it's 100% volunteer. People don't realize that. And it is a nonprofit, and we're very fortunate. We get a grant from the state of Rhode Island, a grant from the state of Massachusetts, and we have sponsors who help us along the way. And it's made a huge difference. And we also get annual fund donations and sponsors from the community who realize that they benefit from our work as well. Restaurants and other businesses that benefit from the improvement in the community. So the new website has not just a listing of the artists who are members, but as you scroll through the artist's pages, you can click on an artist, you can see samples of their work, you can go right over to their website and see what's being created right in your own community. We all are uplifted by the visual arts and being able to share that this year, now that the restrictions are gone, being able to share that with the outer community, with those who are not artists but appreciate art, I think their appreciation has grown as well. We hope you enjoyed this week's Fresh and Local Spotlight. Proudly presented by Cardi's Furniture and Mattresses.